Um, who are you people? My name is Logan. And this is my girlfriend Alicia. We are from Mixed Up Grounded series Sophia the First series. And my name is Alicia. I am Logan's girlfriend and cellmate. I was also from Mixed Up Grounded series Sophia Get Grounded series. How did you both end up here in Hampton, Georgia's Maximum Security Juvenile Hall? We were sent here because we were troublemakers who get in trouble 24-7, snitched on Sophia and bullied Sophia the first and possibly abused her 24-7. That's right. We regret what we did to Sophia in the past and now we got disowned by our families. I got sentenced here for 5 years. I won't be out until I turn 21. Same thing. Even though I was seen in two videos of the Justine series. That was not me. It was an imposter of mine. But I did see you in the video Justine and Annabelle get sent to detention camp video. But since I did more trouble to Sophia, I was sent here for 10 years. And yes, I was disowned by family as well, even though they are against Sophia. Same thing happened to me. I was sent here for bullying Justine 24-7. I even disguised as Justine, broke into her family's house and broke a hole in the wall. I am sentenced to 15 years here along with a 500 feet restraining order from Justine. Oscar Rodriguez. Your family is here to see you and want to have a word with you. They are entering the cell right now. Oh no. That has to be my family. And I think they are furious at me. Um, hey mom and dad. Zachary and Alyssa. Look. I admit it. I did snitch on Justine and cause her to get into trouble at school. Are you guys angry at me? Angry? Huh. Are you kidding me right now? We are extremely furious with you Oscar. Alyssa, Zachary, your mother and I cannot believe you were sentenced to 15 years at juvenile hall for snitching, bullying and getting Justine into trouble multiple times. You even disguised as Justine snuck into her parents' house, and threw a hammer at the wall in her parents' living room and got Justine in trouble with her parents. What the hell is wrong with you? Words cannot describe how furious we are for what you did to one of your classmates. That's right Oscar. I agree with your dad big time. Do you realize how much damage you have caused to Justine Quinn Scudder? Thanks to you Oscar. She destroyed her house with a bomb and got her parents living in a hotel and got Alice Scudder, Justine's mom to torture and assault her extremely. You seriously had to do this to her parents. That's right. Sonny Scudder, who is Justine's previous dad, blamed Justine for something she didn't do and blew up her old house and was beaten up by her former mother, which left her severely injured with black marks on her face. You started it. Because of what you did. Justine had the worst day ever because of what you did. Now look at yourself. You're in juvenile hall for the next 15 years. How would you feel if we did this to you? Huh? We also got a video of what happened to Justine because of your stupid mischief. Just watch. Since you refuse to kill yourself, I am giving you consequences. Chow 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 That hurts so fucking bad. Stop it. Why? That's what you get for acting so retarded in the past and causing major trouble in the past. Oh wait, that's not harsh enough. Looks like we should Holy give grass. Us. Because you beat me up worse than you do usually? Why? See that? This is what actually happened to Justine thanks to your stupid idea to sneak into Justine's house and for breaking a hole on the wall. You are done. So done. Big time. Okay. Okay. Zachary. I am extremely sorry for what I put Justine into. I did this because she beated me up with a frying pan and did so much bad things to me, Mr. Butler and Principal Salomo back in October and November of 2022. Please let me out. And I promise I will never do any more trouble to Justine and be a better kid from now on. Please, no. 
Don't apologize to me. Apologize to your former classmate Justine Quinn Scudder for all the trouble you did to her. And besides, we don't care about what she did to you and the entire school. It could be because of her abusive parents, her former teacher and principal, and how you treated her in the fall of 2022 and 2023. But mom and dad, I don't think she will accept my apology, and she will deny it big time. Well, it is your own fault for what you did to her in both your school and at the Denver Juvenile Detention Center. I bet she is furious at you for getting her into big trouble and snitching on her multiple times. Yeah. This is why we sent you to juvenile detention in September and to detention camp in December of last year. But you never learned. No wonder you are sentenced to 15 years. Along with your teacher for 20 years. And your principal for 45 years. Maybe if you haven't been doing all of these horrible things to Justine in the past. Then you would have never been in this cell. We also saw the March of Shame aka Justine's Embarrassment Parade where you wore a diaper and looked like a Cupid in the parade. Along with the live event of Justine and Annabelle's parents having their punishment day and have been executed for what they have done to their daughters 24-7. Everyone hates you for what you did to her. Oh my god. Please do not mention that stupid parade. I was humiliated out of my life from that parade. I saw so many people laugh at my Cupid outfit. Please. It is embarrassing. Well, we all laughed at your Cupid outfit. Because you deserve it for bullying Justine every day. Also, Justine will be living a better life with her sister Annabelle. And her new family since her previous parents are dead. And there is no possible way to revive them. Along with you, your teacher and principal. The judge and the seven wanted police officers since they will never do any harm to them ever again. You know what? We are done with you. Big time. Starting today. You will be disowned and kicked out of our family forever for what you did to your classmate. And you are grounded until you're dead. No. Please don't disown me mom and dad. I promise never to do this to just he never again. Can I please still be in your family? Absolutely. Not. You caused our lives in jeopardy. We had to apologize to Justine for what you did to her and we told you that we would disown you for what you did. It is over. Everyone hates you for what you did to her big time. That's right Oscar. We are writing the disowned papers and after that. We will be heading home to Vion City. And since you will be turning 21 after your prison sentence. We are so done with you, permanently. Have fun in your cell at Juvenile Hall for 15 years and without a family. Goodbye and fuck you. Great. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe my parents are disowning me for what I did to Justine. This is all my fault. Why did I turn into Justine and sneak into her parents' house and punch a hole in their wall with a hammer? I ruined my own life and now everyone hates me for what I did to Justine. Don't worry about it Oscar. Well, you still have us until we turn 18. Once we turn 18, we will be transferred to jail. All of you just stop it. Just, stop it. My life is is so over. I wish I was never born. Wa 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 w